Long time no see everybody. So I've been doing really good lately. Um, had a lot of motivation to do stuff and everything. So uh, the last couple days I've been thinking that I want to make a new goal. Uh, I think I've hit my goals a little bit faster than kind of expected and I just need to do more. So over the last couple days I've been contemplating and I have decided that I wanted to run a, a half marathon. I wasn't sure if I really could, didn't really know, so I was looking at training programs and I uh, decided that I can do it. It's going to take a lot of work to be able to run that 13.1 miles, but you know, if I put my mind to it, I know I can. So this morning at work, I signed up and registered for my first half marathon. Uh, it's just crazy even thinking about it, you know, thinking back in October where I could barely run a mile. Um, you know, now I'm you know, running you know, four miles, no problem. You know, my highest I've ran so far is 6.5. So I've put together a training program for the next 12 weeks until the until the half marathon. And I, f I modified Hal Higdon, I think is his name, Hal Higdon's training program. I asked a lot of people through the diet bet as well as other people that I know that do running and that's what they recommended. And I guess a lot of people have had a lot of success with it. Um, so yeah. So I'm going to try to be a little bit more efficient and be a little bit better about videoing because I want to be able to see what my progression is. So hopefully this will help me drop some weight while I'm at it. I'm sure if I you know, stick to it, I know I can. So my training program isn't going to start until uh, Sunday for sure, uh, but I'm just going to get in a couple small runs today and tomorrow. Um, my son's asleep right now, so I'm just going to run as long as he'll allow me. He's been really sick, so um, I'm not sure how long he'll allow me today. Hoping to get in, you know, two, three miles. Uh, just something nice and easy. Not push it too hard. What I've been reading on, uh, reading up on, is with this training program and just training up for any kind of long distance race. I heard that, excuse me, I heard that first off, it's good not to worry about your time and your pace at all uh, in the first race. You know, just make sure you finish. But... I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. I know I can, and I know that you guys can push yourselves harder as well. You know, so find what you guys you know like and and come up with a uh, a new plan. Oh, I should tell you, I stopped at Walmart today. It's kind of ironic that I'm wearing this shirt on the first training day. Well, not first training day, but uh, the day I sign up for uh, this half marathon. It's kind of funny. It, I got this shirt at Walmart for three bucks. It says, running sucks. And <laughs> I think it'd be kind of funny if I wore like this shirt or the other shirt I got for $3 at Walmart today. Um, the, I think the one downstairs, I'll have to show you if I remember when I go downstairs when I'm done running today. It says something to the effect of, if you don't believe me, just watch. And I think it'd be kind of fun to watch and to wear that on half marathon day, which is June 21st. Um, so yeah, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and run today, see how I do. Again, I hope I haven't been on here for a while, I've been watching all your guys' videos still. Oh, you guys are doing great, you know, keep it up. Um, and yeah, talk to you guys in a while. Peace. So my son started to cry, as you can hear, and so I'm done running for the day. I may do a little bit later this evening when he goes to sleep, but I put in two and a half miles in 27 minutes, two seconds, and I walked the first two minutes, so I feel pretty good about that. So yeah, it's been a couple days since I've ran though, so I was a little bit tired, more tired than usual, so yeah. Good go. morning. It, right now it is just a little bit after eight, it's about quarter after eight in the morning, and it is beautiful. The sun's just barely coming over the mountains. Um, yeah. So I'm going to start, um, well, like I said, my training doesn't start officially until tomorrow. Um, and tomorrow is just like a stretching day. And so uh, I'm going to go on a four mile run, however. Well, I'd say three and a half to four. We'll see how it goes. And uh, see how I do. So got my music blaring in my ears. And 
let's get my map my map my run up and get this work done do Ooh, work that's a good run sorry i didn't video any of my run itself i just got kind of caught up in the moment and was just running so i did four miles and if you follow me on map my run you'll see it but I did it in four miles in 30, oh, I just went away. There's an average pace of nine minutes, three seconds. Actually a lot faster than I was even planning and almost even wanted to go. Um, but I did it in 36 minutes, 13 seconds for four miles. So I was pretty happy with that. Um, there's my route. You can kind of see it as soon as it focuses. Um, so it felt pretty good, uh, believe it or not, like I said. Um, so yeah, in a have some kind of good breakfast and then make sure I eat good uh, the rest of the day just like usual and just keep working hard and pushing to, uh, to hit my goal because I know I can do it so uh, if you guys are have not worked out yet today get out and do something you now whether it's even just walking around the, the your neighborhood for 15 minutes any every little bit helps you know it's gotten to me gotten me to where I am today and it's going to get me to where I want to be also. Just getting out and doing every little thing I can to, to make my life as healthy as possible. So uh, have a great day. See ya.